Good afternoon. My name is Eva Hunley, and I've lived in Loveland. I've lived in Loveland for many, many years. When I come to Loveland, it was really a historical town. Right where this old building set was a food, was a food pantry, a slaughtering house, ice house. Everything in Loveland, historical, is gone, and I'd like to know why it's going away. This brochure tells about the train track. It's a big sign right over here. It tells all about the train. The trains was coming through Loveland before any of us was born. Before any of us was here. The trains aren't allowed to blow. Why? What does that hurt? The tire right here on, on the works. The clock. It's quick ticking. It, if it was one o'clock, it'd go bing, and it would play a real pretty melody. What does that hurt? Who's that? Who's that? But now, I'd just like to know why everything in some level of historical is gone. Could anybody say why all this is happening? Why did the train stop blowing? Who, who was that affected? Uh, the train stopped blowing because the city created a quiet zone as part of our agreement with the development across the street. Um, so we raised six kids and raised And the, um, I take care of the, the chimes that you're hearing that are, are over the top of the works. Um, it, I, I had it working. It's just been malfunctioning. I will get it back working. It just. I sure hope so. I, I had it working. <laughs> <laughs> uh, back. I just, wish you'd go back and try I, to get all the other stuff. I, 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 I will get on tomorrow. I, I'm 80 years old. I ain't going to live much longer. <laughs> <laughs> but I'd like to see a historical story when I die. I'd like to know my kids will know that they were born and raised in Loveland, Ohio. A historical town.